I'm here in Medjugorje next to St. James Church and I'm with, what's your name, Father? Uh, please excuse me. What's your name? I am Father Joshi Nechimialil from India, Kerala. Yeah. My congregation's name is Missionaries of Compassion, mm -hmm. founded by Father Jos Kaimlet. Uh, beautiful. And you say you are the first time here in Medjugorje? I am first time in Medjugorje. It was a great and wonderful experience for me. Mm -hmm. Mother Mary has revealed so many good things to me and it was a great joy in my priestly ministry. Mm -hmm. And it gives us a lot of divine energy and spiritual enthusiasm to mm -hmm. do more and more good compassionate work to the glory of God mm -hmm. and to the good of the people of God. Wow, beautiful. I see it. Really, it was a great occasion in my life. I never forget it. It is always a great zeal I have got from God through the intercession of Mother Mary in Medjugorje. It's a great, great thing. I am really happy and uh, mm -hmm. filled my heart and uh, mind with a lot of divine joy and peace I cannot express because more than that, uh, uh -huh. that great joy, uh -huh. really, yeah. mm, really it is. Uh, so many people yesterday, one taxi driver who came to me and mm -hmm. told the father, uh, you are from India but I don't know your language but seeing your face and your happiness, uh, he came to me and he took me to my hotel freely and he was telling, please pray for me and gave me a picture. That's the intervention of Mother Mary in my life. That taxi driver from here, this mm -hmm. place, he was so happy. Mm -hmm. And telling, Father, you are witnessing God. I have seen something mm -hmm. special, grace of God, some charism in you. It's a, really, it's a great uh, miracle I have got from Mother, um, Mother Mary Medjugorje. It's really great. Mm -hmm. And I see you pray the rosary. You have a beautiful rosary here. Yeah, Why yeah. Why do you pray the rosary, Father? Because uh, all the life mm -hmm. of Mother Mary mm -hmm. and Jesus' public life in the mysteries of light, that uh, always guide me, lead me, and give me a lot of courage and uh, uh, dedication to do good in the midst of difficulties. We have a lot of difficulties to proclaim the gospel in India, mm -hmm. but when I recite the Holy Rosary, I am forgetting all the difficulties and going and preaching, mingling with all people, not only our Catholic or Christian, all religion, even mm -hmm. Hindus and Muslims, whoever coming, mm -hmm. I am sharing my divine experience with them. Mm -hmm. yes. the, behind all this uh, inspiration I am getting through the rosaries. I used to uh, recite more than 12, 13 rosaries a day. And today morning I have recited four rosaries. Mm -hmm. While coming from my hotel to the church, I was reciting. And I have got half an hour in the sacristy there also, I was uh, reciting the rosary. Mm -hmm. It gives me a lot of spiritual joy and happiness in my I life. See. Really, you really. Shine, Father. You shine. Uh, really, it is a great gift of uh, Mother Mary, Mother of Medjugorje. Really, lot of conviction I have got to do and to die for my Jesus. That is really the, the, the intercession of Mother Mary. Mm -hmm. Her inter intervention is great in mm -hmm. my life. Thank you, really. Really, it is a great occasion. And you know, here in Medjugorje, confession, here next to the confessionals, which are over there on the left, the international ah. ones, you know, um, confession is so central here in Medjugorje. Yeah, 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 there are yeah. a lot of people, they are scared to go oh, to confession. Okay, 20 yeah, years, yeah, maybe oh, they didn't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. What would you tell them at the priest about the beauty of confession? Yeah. The confession is uh, <clears throat> um, making friendship with God. So, when we are going on the path of evil things, evil words, evil actions, and uh, against uh, the divine virtues, mm -hmm. so God is inviting them, come to me, repent upon your sins, and enter, I am the way. I am the truth and I am the life. You please come. I am the Father. I am the God of mercy and compassion. Mm -hmm. Whoever comes to me, 
they will have the joy happiness and they will find everything whatever they don't like anything in their life that is a great invitation from the part of jesus the sacrament of confession whoever even the prodigal son how the father was embracing and accepting that is what we are experiencing in the confession during the time of confession so that's a great sacrament we cannot forget in our life because jesus is accepting and embracing us he is forgetting about our past life and leading us into a new creation and new life to do it's beautiful very very, very beautiful unimaginable nowhere we get after the confessions many people in in india kerala many people are in queue for the confession mm-hmm. and they came and told me father really it is a great joy in our life and a mental peace mm-hmm. we are after that we are experiencing a peace in their mind that's a great thing really really it was nothing it's for free and uh, day before yesterday i came i was celebrating holy mass in the italian uh, language mm-hmm. one man just 5 minutes before the holy mass came and told father i want to receive the holy communion because so long 20 years i was not uh, receiving please give me listen and i would like to have the confession then i told only 5 minutes no problem father even 2 minutes also i would like to receive the holy communion then with the permission of the other father who is in charge i listened and i have given him confession and the great joy that i have seen in his face that gives me lot of uh, happiness and joy in my life because i am remembering god's invitation to confession god's invitation every now and then jesus is telling come to me come to me i am the bread i am the life so the life everybody should get yes everybody yes. thank you and you know a lot of people you saw maybe in it a lot of people think god the father is a old man with a white beard very angry and wants to judge us and this is not right no god the, the father can you god the father is the father of mercy and compassion he has only one son only begotten son he sent to this world because out of his mercy and compassion uh-huh. he sent to this world to redeem the world and give salvation to all the people for that uh-huh. he sent his son otherwise he cannot send because out of his generosity love mercy and compassion he wanted to save the people from the bondage of sins and evil and the world should enjoy the <coughs> the uh, love and mercy of god and uh, uh, god the father wanted to make everybody the children of god the children of god happy That's, children like you uh, yeah yeah uh-huh. okay. and you know i see you have a personal relationship with christ this is the most important thing in our catholic faith how can somebody have a personal relationship with god or christ personal relationship gives us a lot of courage mm-hmm. enthusiasm mm-hmm. and also we will have a good hope that's uh, come from the, the, the personal relationship with god in the midst of danger in the midst of difficulties in the midst of problem we will have a courage to face all this problem with this close relationship with jesus mm-hmm. because i know that if i am in the midst of so many enemies mm-hmm. or so many wanted to attack me because of the kingdom of god because of the proclamation of the uh, the gospel mm-hmm. then if i have a close relation with jesus nothing is uh, uh, nothing will be an obstacle for me i am not at all worried about all those things that is the and even something happened against my personal life in my personal what i expect and what i wish mm-hmm. i don't get i don't be desperate because i have that close relation with jesus nothing can separate me
And how can you have that relationship if somebody doesn't have it? Uh, through the prayer. Prayer is the power. Prayer is the best weapon. Mm -hmm. So when we have the prayer, mm -hmm. so we will have become very close to Jesus. When I am very close, I will have the freedom to come and share mm -hmm. and uh, receive and whatever you give, I will be very happy because we are good friends. If I am not uh, happy, you. Mm, you, you never know me. You uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if I am uh, very close to you, I yeah. am free to ask. Yeah. If I am very close to Jesus, uh -huh. I will be free to ask anything. And I am always very happy to uh -huh. be with him yes. because we have a close relation. And if we don't have a close relation, God will say, I do not know. Uh -huh. I have never seen you. Where were you? So if we have a close relation, when I come there itself, Jesus will extend his hands. Come, my dear son. We are good friends. We are close friends. Uh -huh. You are always living with me. You are always in the heart of mine. Mm -hmm. So that relation, mm -hmm. nobody can separate, even persecutions, problems, difficulties, poverty, anything, nothing. That close relation will make us more strong in our life. Really uh, and so what is your favorite place here in Medjugorje? You have a favorite place? I went there where Mother Mary's apparition had happened. In uh, an, uh, um, Apparition Hill or uh, mountain? mountain? There I went yesterday during the time of heavy rain. Uh -huh. Then also I climbed to there and recited the Holy Rosary and prayed and uh, it was really uh, the, 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 the great uh, God's presence I have experienced. So Mother Mary's presence and also where Mother Mary is there, Jesus will be there. Where Jesus is there, Mother Mary and Saint Joseph will be there. So I experienced their presence there. Uh -huh. That gives me a lot of spiritual happiness and joy. Wow, now I'm you have, have to go. Yeah. The last question, um, why should people come to Medjugorje? What would you tell? Because they wanted to have the close relation with Jesus uh -huh. through the intercession of Mother Mary. They wanted to leave the way of evil and sins and they wanted to enter into the heart of Jesus through the intercession of Mother Mary. Really, that is a great thing. So, so many wanted to have the conversion of their evil life, evil words, evil actions, evil thoughts, and they wanted to enter mm -hmm. into the very heart of Jesus through the intercession of Mother Mary. That's why many people are coming here, uh -huh. and they are getting a lot of grace lot of blessings through uh -huh. the intercession of Mother Mary. I have experienced uh -huh. so many people shared me yesterday. They have got great joy and happiness. Now they are uh, more close to Jesus through the intercession of Mother Mary. Thank so, you so much you. for this beautiful interview. Father. You are very welcome. Thank you very much. Thank Do you, you want to give a blessing for the people who are watching this video at the end? Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I take the blessing as well. May Almighty God bless all the people who are not close with Jesus. They have a lot of sufferings, problems, poverty and financial crisis and bondages in life. May the good Lord bless all of them. Jesus may embrace and keep them in, their, in His holy cart and they may always enjoy the real presence of Jesus in their family and in their personal life in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you.